someone has gone through a day and only lost three legs. But both were in Group C. That was John O'Shea and Jamie Lewis. They were last year. 108. And he's at it again. Daniel, you're required 32. You don't think he's going to miss this time when he's had a second bite of the cherry. Game he's shot been the finding the target. Leg. Daniel closer. He's a learning machine, this guy. One down, three to go. To have second leg. It's a perfect to day. First. Game on. And to back up an eight-point day on Monday with an improved Tuesday. This is fast becoming his group. As McGinney piles in the game's first max, I'm going to show you his... Most of the time, he's, he's putting in six visit legs. He's finding just a shade over a third of his doubles. It just goes to show, in this group, that is a formula that works. 81. He has been... That's a big improvement. Massively. And here's the weirdest one of all, courtesy of... The man, the myth, the genius, Mark Walker. All hail Mark. Mark, you require 155. He's a man of mystique. Could Mark McGinney give us an effort of magnifique? Ooh, the guitar solo of a 155. Game That's more like it. Mode. That's more gladiatorial. Phenomenal. And even then, no massive show of respect leg, from Daniel, Daniel Closer. First. Just a nice wink Game on. and a nod of the head as if to say, yes, Mark, that was very good. So I'm in this Mark game as a bit 28. of breathing space. Has double 14 for a break of throw. And to condemn closer to only a fifth leg lost in the day. Game shot on the third And it leg. goes. Marmagini. I just knew he was going to hit that, Henry. Such a perfect lie. As long, not that he's too bothered about things like that. All he wants to do is get the points, whether it's 4-2 or 4-3. But it's more difficult now than it once looked. 93. And maybe this time tomorrow, he might be having a look at the local attractions and the local directory to see what to do with a couple of days off because he is sprinting towards the finishing line in recommendation if you've got an afternoon free. Can't say that I have much spare time in Portsmouth when I come here. I spend 99% of my free time here. Mark McGinney Daniel today, he's been so 88. stoic in trying to battle through some of these matches, but I think he's going to be drawn into a bit of a battle again. Double 10. Game shot Man, what a perfect leg. double 10 that Daniel is. Daniel Closer. That was right in the equator, right in the epicenter. I'm sensing a pattern when we commentate together, Henry. It's, it's just a gap of years. <laughs> Welcome to your daily dose of look oh, how old Nico is compared to Henry. Well, opportunity, Daniel however, he's left himself on double 14 just to be safe, just in case. He misses. Game but that was inevitable, five. wasn't it? The double Daniel five closer. going in. Mark, you require 84. Maybe an opening for McGinney to make it 3-3 free free and maybe... Nico's prediction comes true if the double 12 goes Game and we will the go way. to Marmagini. the distance to a decider and Daniel Closer has lost as many legs in this particular match as he has done for the rest of the day. Seven final leg, it's Daniel to throw He's first. not going to join the party. Game on. Daniel, Did he find the right 32. double? To seal. The perfect Tuesday. Game shot. And there it is. The Daniel, Closer Daniel Closer closes out. A remarkable day at the Super Series for him. He has picked up all 10 points that was available to him with a 90.92 average in a 4 3 success against Mark McGinney. Three maximums in the game. Four for nine on the doubles. A high out of 88. 
and after two days play in group a daniel closer finds himself on 18 points at the minute he has a lead of eight points that could be the case come the end of the day it could be reduced to six depending on what happens in our final two matches greg ritchie is looking to close the gap and give himself a glimmer of hope going into the final day's action when he takes on peter jakes after this short break <laughs>